Hey everybody, to 100 today, welcome to more Enchanted Book and School Wizardry! Last time we dealt with a poltergeist who was a bit more suave and sophisticated than I initially thought he was, um, given the voice that I gave him. This time, we're going to be taking another trip into Hades. Not literally, but we are going to be going, dealing with something that is to do with the underworld. I did, in fact, get someone asking me in the comments uh, whether or not I'd cover this one, and oh dear. I hope that those white flashes are uh, not going to be to come on because the display on my DS has just frozen but it still seems to be playing just fine on the let's just hope that that's okay oh god I don't oh dear anyway we want to head over this way oh she came to the doggy he's so cute look at him he's so adorable oh what are you doing Oh boy, he breathed fire on me. Okay, what we have to do to deal with this is he cast a rain-making incantation, which is what I understand the person contacting me had the issue with. Clear day, so you want incantation, sun, sad, hold an aquamarine. So make sure you have one of those before you start. Hopefully no one's going to show up, and the screen seems to sort itself out, hallelujah. I don't particularly want to have to replace this because this was kind of pricey. Oh, what was it again? It was sunny. Um, date? No, no, no. Sunny, sad. Sun, sad, wasn't it? There we go. Sun, sad. And hold out. An aquamarine. This shouldn't take too long. Now, when it's starting to rain, let's approach the dog again, because everyone knows that water and fire don't go together. He's confused. Okay, what you want to do is go into there and say, Greetings, friend. Uh, greeting, friend. It's okay, it's okay. So, now step forward. Basically treat this like, like like you would with any scared animal. Be slow, be patient, and keep reassuring it. Yeah, okay, okay. I've got this one one more time. I think if I'm doing this correctly. Come on, come. You're okay. You're okay. I was gonna ask this who we are. Okay, I'm apologies. Wild hound. Technically it's a hellhound, but uh it's fine. I could tell it we're Percy from Percy Jackson uh, yeah, from Percy Jackson, because if you read the series he knows he ha you know he has a hellhound called Mrs. O'Leary. Don't ask. <laughs> but she he doesn't look much like Mrs. O'Leary. Wanna respond with friend. He wants to get to the dorm. So, we have to lead him. Once again, you'd think with having four legs and being utterly adorable that he'd be able to keep up with us a little more easily. No! No, 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 no. Sorry, Pamela. He walks about as slowly as any other NPC and it's really annoying. <laughs> Why do you do that? And freak successfully freaking out Bernard is just a dog. I mean, look at him, he's adorable. He's practically a growlith. Practically an albino growlith. Because, you know, breathes fire. So, he's so cute. Anyway, go in here. Yep, we're at the dorm. Oh, Holly, where did you find him? I just saw him around here a little while ago. I went out to find what I need, what I needed to catch him, but he was gone by the time I got back. Couldn't get, on, get it off my mind ever since. What is he? I'm guessing he's what they call a wild hound. 
Probably wandered in through some door somewhere. Probably the one upstairs. <laughs> He's going home now. You and me friends are. I'm happy to meet you. Very happy to meet you, I think is what he said. Good job. I mean, he's basically a big chicken. Must have come. Must have been tough getting him to come with you. I'll take it from here. Don't worry. I'll make sure he doesn't wander back over this side again. He's adorable. I want to hug him and squeeze him. And given that we're only six minutes in, and it's Sunday. We go see Captain Dot. So I'll meet you on the island. Cause why the heck not? He needs some he needs some sense putting into him after last time anyway. Let's go kick his ass one more time, shall we? He kinda deserves it at this point. Aye, ah, it's just me old Lan Labaholic. Long time no see. I saw you last week. Just in time, I got to pay you back for the last time we asked a run in. So have I. My pirate pants, which I'm already wearing. It's giving me repeats now. Great. Um, as we fight, I want to give a quick update. Uh, as to why there have been no Sutter Rubber videos, but there have been Enchanted Folk. Enchanted Folk is, fr frankly, easier to make. Oh. Easy to record and easy to edit for me. And because I'm back at home, I have to deal with my parents and everyone else's schedules. Because I hate recording when there are other people in the house because because they walk in and it's embarrassing. Ugh. And it's really annoying. Say say they walk in when I'm do, trying to middle, middle explaining something. I I had to put up with them. Or cut out the whole thing and start the exp explanation again. So it, it, it gets annoying and I... I've only just managed to get it done today because my parents are out and I don't know how long they're going to be out for. So I don't know if I'm going to record even more and risk it or what. So that's why there haven't been so much sort of, so many sort of rubber episodes because I just hate, I hate it when my parents walk in. I've got nowhere else to record. And if I go upstairs and there's a chance of them coming upstairs and the floorboards creak like you wouldn't believe. You can hear them next door. Where I am now, people, it's the kitchen so everyone walks in and out and living room is just awkward so you can't you can't have a problem I might just be seeing as being pedantic here or just plain fussy but it does really annoy me you know, I, and I have no right to say please don't come in here because it, it's their house technically they can come in it's not it's not something I can really do much about can't wait for September when I have my own place so much easier. Anyway, I'm probably about eight minutes in. I've got nothing else to talk about or do. So, this has been the shift to 100. I shall see you guys next time. Farewell.